Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Now this is just a quick video to show you something that I'm going to be talking a lot more about in a future video, but I think it's interesting enough just to show you this little bit on its own. Now what you are looking at on the screen is a piece of hardware called the Y Spy DBX and a piece of software called Channelizer, and I'm going to be talking about this in a separate video. However, it is a Wi-Fi and 2.4 and 5.8 gigahertz analyzer, and I'm using it to take a look at how the DJI digital FPV system actually works. And I've actually come across something quite interesting with regards to people complaining about the system wiping other users out on power on. Now we know Know this happens and we've all got used to actually dealing with this behavior but what I want to just share with you is actually why this happens now what I'm going to do is turn on my digital FPV system it is set to channel 8 on 20 5 milliwatts and what I want to do is demonstrate to you how the system actually behaves at first power on and that will explain why we see people say it wipes out other DJI FPV users as well as analog users around them as well. So let me just plug the quad in. Now what you will see is the quad turn on and you'll see this large mass of signal appear on the screen and this is that digital FPV OFDM video feed filling up. Now this is the actual interesting part. What you're about to see next is it fill up and then drop off to a lower level and as you can see the red is actually filling up, but it's not filling all of the way. It's filling and leaving a yellow gap at the top, which is going to begin to fall away. And what this is showing is when the DJI digital FPV system first turns on, it actually kicks in at full 1200 milliwatts. And then after about two seconds, it falls down to the desired power output that you have set on the system. So as you can see here, we had that initial mass of signal and then it's dropped down to a smaller, more lower level. And that is why people get this behavior with the digital FPV system wipes out other users because when it is kicking in, it is kicking in to that full 12 milliwatt, 1200 I should say, milliwatt power output. Now there is something else interesting about this with regards to people using the digital FPV system with the DJI remote. Whilst the FPV system does have eight channels, the remote controller appears to stay on channel eight at all times. No matter what you actually set the FPV video channel to, the remote controller channel is always on channel 8 and this is why when someone powers on another DJI digital FPV system around you it always powers on to channel 8 first and then it will jump to the desired channel that you have pre-selected before but when it does fire up on that initial 12 100 milliwatts, that is what is wiping people out. Now, this, what I'm showing you here, is going to actually be part of a much larger video where we start talking about the DJI Digital FPV system and showing you guys all of the modes, how the actual signal looks as well on all of the modes as well, whether it be on 25, 200, 500, 750, 1000, 1200 milliwatts and the 50 megabits mode as well and showing you all of the behavior around that because there are some quite interesting things to this as well. Now if you're interested in seeing that please do hit that subscribe button on the channel but I just thought I'd share this little tidbit with you Anyway, that's it for this one. As I've said, please do hit the subs button and if you want to see the rest of it, the other video will probably be coming out in between one to two weeks.